hello! I'm finally filming a YouTube video! I just never got around to filming YouTube videos anymore because I was kind of busy and I just never had like any motivation or any ideas to create any kind of content. Yeah, excuses. I know. But I'm just excited to say that I'm finally trying to actively do this YouTube thing more often and like figure out what kind of content I want to make just because I think I want to make full use of my final year in university. Yay! Yeah, it's finally the first week of um, the academic term. So school hasn't officially started yet. My first class is next week, next Monday. And um, today's just a lot of like events happening around uni and it's mostly for the freshers and I'm already in my third year. I mean going to my third year. Oh my god. Can't believe it's already third year but I'm going to be a third year student, final student. Final year student, I'm gonna graduate soon. Oh my god, okay. Stress. Yeah, okay. One of the few reasons why I've decided to like just turn on this camera for once, once after a few months, is that I just wanna look back at my year. Just like a recap, you know, about my life in uni, especially in year two. I think like the jump from the first year to the second year, second year was really huge. Like I've already like had this thinking in my head after like so many seniors told me that oh your jump to second year is gonna be very hard and like um you need to be mentally prepared about the workload that's going to increase and how the lecturer's um, expectations of you are just going to like increase and I did mentally prepare myself for that like I knew that you know it's not going to be as easy as year one and um but I still thought not really lah <laughs> it's just life happens you know like it was fun I did talk about this to a couple of my friends and like I went to different kind of like interpretations or like reflections about what I thought of my year two, and at first it was it, it, I I came to this conclusion that you know I just played a lot in year two. I went to like if you follow my Instagram, I went to like a concert every month, like at least once a month. I didn't really like um pick up any kind of CCA or like join any clubs or societies or whatever. Um, I quit rugby. I thought that like it was just too expensive and just too time consuming for me. Even though I love the sport. If you could pick up a new sport, I'd say join rugby. Rugby is really fun. Rugby union is where the fun is all at. But yeah. I just wasn't into that life anymore, that sports athletes. Student athlete life anymore. Also, I guess like in year two, I start to question things more critically. Especially when I'm doing my assignments, I feel like I'm not just putting in sources because you know I have to meet that number of um, sources for each essay. But I'm actually looking about how these sources can um, help in my essay writing or just help in my general thought process. That was a very like um, very crucial moment for me in as a year two student because I start to understand that hey, not everything that's given to you is credible and that you should be questioning every source, every information that you get and you know not just see at face value and I think that sense of critical thinking has just enveloped me as a person, as a student and I find that I'm more aware of critically analysing everything that's happening in my head, in my life it's a good thing, it's a bad thing, but I overall feel like it's a good skill that I picked up in year two. And I think that it's something, it's a skill that you they will definitely pick up as you go and learn and write more essays in university. And I think that was cool. I also picked up more recipes to try. So I thought like my year two I was more adventurous in terms of the diversity of recipes that I tried to cook for myself. and. I think I, it was the year that I started cooking Malay dishes. Like my first ever kua, kua Melayu that I cook is um, it's what? Lemak, lemak cili padi. 
and I didn't have chicken so I put like fish and it was nice because my way of home because my mom likes to cook lemak chili padi with like um fish and yeah it was nice it was really good and it was in winter so like it was so spicy and hot but because of the weather it was like the perfect dish ever um yeah I enjoyed that I like cooking and I think like a lot of people also enjoyed seeing my Insta stories where I cook. My mom also liked it, lol. Uh, so yeah, I'm definitely gonna continue cooking even more. Besides that, I felt like I met a lot of new people in year two. The friends that I made in year two are definitely friendships that I will definitely hold on to even after I graduate and like, I just appreciate all this cool people in my life you know who you are I think you're watching this if you're not but I don't know but like, yeah in year two I was surrounded like with people that really cared for me and I thought that that was really nice because really had a lot of like mental breakdowns in uni because of my essays but I knew that like with the touch of my phone I could just like send a text to somebody and say like hey I'm like damn stressed like can go somewhere or like like hey what y'all doing talk to me like just distract me from like uni in a good way you know but yeah it was a year that I realized that was that I was never alone even though I was alone but because you're in Liverpool so you never walk alone <laughs> hey <laughs> Sorry, I have to like adjust this every other minute because I never wear my ninja. My ninja is on the way with Inka who is at like Manchester airport but she's in Liverpool soon and yeah she brought my ninja from Singapore. Shout out to Amanina who like bought it from me in Singapore and now I have new ninjas. FYI, if you don't know what ninja is, it's just the cloth that like hijabis wear underneath their tudung or their hijab to prevent their hijab from like falling off. So like, yeah, that's about it man. I mean like, year 2 was really fun. I really enjoyed year 2. It was, there's so much more memory, there was so much meaningful memories. Dude, I saw like BTS twice. Not in a year, but like within a span of a year. Twice. One in O2 Arena, another one at Wembley Stadium. Okay, but that's another story, okay. But yeah, it was cool. It was really nice. I really liked it. I feel like now looking back at what I've done in year 2, year 3, I want Two. Year 2 has been like a year for me. It was really very selfish. It was for in a good way. Like like I did things that I wanna do, you know, and didn't really put others first. I mean like I put me myself first and I thought that was a really nice change. Uh but yeah, but like year three I've I've signed up for like cool stuff that's gonna happen in the future, hopefully inshallah. And um really looking forward for that and just diving head into uni. Can you actually believe I'm excited for uni to start? Cause like I want to read and I want to learn more. It's just the thought of like physically waking up for like. Okay lah, my class is not so bad. It's only at nine thirty p.m. Nine thirty a.m. And my school is so near. Okay, I won't copy. Alhamdulillah, I won't copy. <laughs> We're seeing. I just like uni. I thought I. Inshallah, I think year three will be a good one. And yeah. That's it from me, I guess. That's all my updates uh, that that I owe you, no, or not really. I don't really owe you anything, yeah. But like, just all my updates so far. And I'm so excited to create more content here. And I'm just gonna try a bit harder at this YouTube thing. And hopefully, oh, you see what I mean? I don't have a ninja. I should have a ninja. Yeah. And hopefully, more content is coming in your way. Bye!